Hey, welcome back to CTM Chat Online. My name is Amani. Today we'll be talking about how to stop making the same mistakes during your dating and courting life. Now, during your dating and courting life, when you're getting to know people, you're going for dates and you're seeing prospects and everything, it's very easy to get caught up in patterns that um, where you're just making the same mistakes over and over again. And as time goes by, you could become very self-cautious about yourself and thinking, oh my God, I'm always doing this. I'm always sabotaging myself. Because, you know, we think sometimes that, yeah, the devil is preventing me from getting married. We forget that. He uses simple things as patterns and mistakes that you've been making in your relationship life and when you're quoting and when you're dating. So how do you stop this? You know, they say it takes 21 days to change a habit. But I've got news for you. We have the Holy Spirit. As a Christian, you have the Holy Spirit. You don't need 21 days. <laughs> With the Holy Spirit, he can change you from the inside out and it can be in an instant and you will start to see him just walking through you to the depths of your heart and dealing with things in such a beautiful manner because he's an amazing teacher. How do we know this? I'd like us to read from John 20, no, John 14 verse 26 that says, But the counselor, the Holy Spirit, whom the Father will send in my name, will teach you all things and will remind you of everything I have said to you. This lets us know that the Holy Spirit is a counselor and a teacher. Sometimes when it comes to relationship and courting, you think, why, why should I say a counselor because of this? You know, it's a bit intense, right? But you keep making the same mistakes and, you know, you've gotten yourself in situations you do not really want to get yourself into and your heart has been broken and you get another opportunity and voila, same mistake again. The Holy Spirit is there. He will guide you. He'll be your counselor and he's such a gentle spirit and, ah, oh, it's very refreshing. Now, the other scripture I'd like to read is Corinthians chapter 2, verses 13, that says, This is what we speak, not in words taught us, taught, not in words taught us by human wisdom, but in words taught by the Spirit, expressing spiritual truths in spiritual words. Now, this lets us know that. Um, there is human wisdom and there is spiritual truth and things that are taught by the spirit. Now, human wisdom can have errors, but what comes from the spirit of God is perfect. So let the Holy Spirit be the one that just oozes out of you and perfect you on the inside out. It could be a dude and you have this habit of just every time you go to meet a lady by date number two, umesha mambo, you're just saying the wrong things and scaring the girls away. Ask the Holy Spirit to guide you. Okay, he's a gentle spirit. And before you know it, things will be going the way they should be going. No more mistakes. We'll see you next time. This is Seatum Touch Online.